In this video, we are going to be comparing Risen tweaks and XNRL tweaks. I'm going to be breaking this down. I'm going to be breaking this down from price, performance, and UI, how much the tweaks improve my performance from a stock Windows, and which tweaks are actually better. And how I'm going to be doing this, I'm going to be factory reset my PC onto a stock Windows, testing my FPS in Creative, then we're going to be going and applying the Risen tweaks and benchmarking our FPS in the same map. Then we're going to be going and resetting our PC again, applying the X and RL tweaks, and we're going to be benchmarking in the same map. So I will see you guys when I factory reset my PC. So guys, I've just factory reset onto stock windows. As you can see, I've just got Fortnite, Google, Epic Games, OBS to record with, and the things you need to render benchmarks in this video. I've loaded up Fortnite and enabled performance mode so you can get the best results out of these tests. And the map that we're going to be using for the benchmarks is going to be the Clicks 1v1, as there's not much in here. It's just really a flat terrain and there's not anything that can decrease my performance. So firstly, I'm going to load this list on a stock windows. Then we're going to be going testing the risen tweaks in this map. Then we're going to be restoring back to stock windows and testing the X and RL tweaks in the same map. So I'm going to load into this map now and we'll be benchmarking on stock windows. So guys, I've just loaded into this map on stock windows. I'm getting a lot of stutters. The game does not feel nice at all. And as you can see in the top right, we're getting about 200 to 300 FPS and it does drop down to about 100 sometimes. So we're going to be going and applying the Risen Tweaks and then we're going to be testing in the same map. So guys, we are going to be testing out the Risen Tweaks now and we're going to be benchmarking those in the same map. But before we do that, if we head on over to the website, you'll be able to see all of the tweak packages here. So you've got all of the ones right here and we are going to be doing the Extreme Tweaks, which are a price of $30. And if you use my code when you check out code Ruffy, you get 15% off so you can get the tweaks for $25. So they're even cheaper. But now if we open up the extreme panel, you'll go onto the homepage where it tells you your specs, your CPU usage and your RAM usage. And on the left here, you've got all of your optimizations. So your Windows optimizations where there's so many tweaks inside here, your network optimizations, dbloat, GPU optimizations and extra optimizations. So there's so many tweaks in here for that small price of $30. I would definitely recommend going and checking it out. But we're going to be doing the Windows optimizations first. And to do these, all you need to do is left click on the tweak and they automatically apply onto your system. You just have to do that for every tweak. So just go through and left click every single tweak inside here that you want to do. It only takes a couple of minutes and then you've tweaked all of your Windows settings. So guys, I've just gone ahead and done all of the Windows optimizations. The same thing goes for the network optimizations. All you need to do is left click on the tweak and it applies. Same thing with the D bloat, you literally just left click on any of these. So say you want to disable your printer services, just left click. You need to just do that for everything. Same for the GPU and the extra optimizations. So I'm going to go through and do this for everything. And then we're going to be running the benchmark in the clicks 1v1 map. So guys, I've gone ahead and done all of the tweaks inside the Risen's Extreme panel. It took me about 10 minutes to do everything. So now I'm going to be loading Fortnite up and we're going to be benchmarking our FPS in the Clicks 1v1 map. So guys, I've just loaded into the Clicks 1v1 with the Risen tweaks enabled. And as you can see in the top right, we're getting about 320 to 390, pushing 400 FPS. And if we do an emote and look up to the sky, we're getting about 500, 520 at a push. So the Risen tweaks have really improved the performance of my PC. But now we're going to be doing a system restore, going and applying the X and RL tweaks and benchmarking them in this exact same map. So guys, I've just done the system restore. So now we're back on stock windows with no tweaks. And now we're going to be testing out the X and RL tweaks. But before we do that, if we head over to the website, you'll be able to see that the X and RL Pro is $30. So it's the same price as Risen's tweaks. But for this, I don't have any discount codes for you guys. So you'll have to pay the full $30. But with that out of the way, we're going to be going ahead and testing the tweaks now. So I'm going to open these up, show you how to apply the tweaks, and then we're going to be benchmarking them in the Clicks 1v1 map. So guys, I've just launched the X and RL tweaks. And as we can see here, we've got your general tweaks, your Windows tweaks, your latency tweaks, keyboard and mouse, power tweaks, all of these. Then you have your hardware tweaks. As you can see, you've got your CPU, GPU, and SSD or hard drive. And all you need to do inside these tweaks to enable them is just tick this box and just enable the option. So as you can see, you just click the on button here and on the same goes for here, you just click these to activate them. I'm going to be doing this for every single tweak. And then I'm going to be restarting my PC. I'm going to be loading Fortnite up. I'm going to be testing these inside Fortnite. So guys, I've gone ahead and enabled all of the tweaks inside here. As you can see, I've done everything. So now I'm going to be restarting my PC and then we're going to be testing them in Fortnite. So guys, I've just loaded up Fortnite with the X and RL tweaks enabled. We're going to be loading into this map now and benchmarking our FPS with the tweaks enabled. So guys, I've just loaded into the map with the X and RL tweaks enabled. And as you can see in the top right, we're getting about 280 to 400 FPS at max. 
It does drop a little bit to like 220 sometimes as well. And if we do an emote and look up to the sky, we're getting about 500 FPS at a push. Not as many as we got with Risen's tweaks, but still good enough to play your game. That is going to be it for this video, guys. As we can see after doing the benchmarks, Risen's tweaks did give us a higher FPS. So I would definitely recommend going and checking those out. I'll leave those links in the description. And if you are buying them, make sure to use code Ruffy when you do purchase them so you can get them for cheaper. But thank you for watching and I'll see you all in the next video.